What's up, Clad Clan? I'm Clouded, and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Glaze Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we finally got off of that island where we were shipwrecked a few episodes ago, and we had a few close calls with Team Fusion. And uh, I I tried recording this once before, and for some reason, my face cam just it didn't record, and you couldn't even hear me talking. It was just the in-game audio and the and the screen. That was that was it. <laughs> I was like, you guys don't want to see that. Um, so this is my second time trying to record this. Hopefully it all comes out okay. And uh, if you guys are glad to see a new episode uh, up for this and you guys are excited and are enjoying this series, uh, please leave a like down below. I'd really appreciate it. Um, especially right now with, with uh, work getting in the way of a lot of my uploads. I'm not um, able to upload them as frequently. So your guys' support uh, really means extra to me right now. So as you guys did see, there was a grinding montage. Uh, at the beginning of this episode, all of our Pokemon are now level 30, so I'm gonna do Team Recrap, Recrap, Team Recrap, yep, Team Recrap, okay, Team Recap, uh, Wind Waker, it has, uh, Quick Attack, Wing Attack, Focus Energy, and Growl, still all the same, but we're gonna teach it something new, uh, shortly, along with probably some of other, uh, team members, uh, Spiral has Poison Sting, Bite, Wrap, and Glare, Finland has Water Gun, Mud Shot, Mud Slap, and Growl, our Simba, Evolved into a Luxray and has Thunderbolt, Bite, Charge, and Swagger. And then uh, Starfy has Psychic, Rest, Swift, and Confusion. So, first things first. Before before we even go to the new area where we're supposed to go to now. See, we're supposed to go to Sea Spray Town, but we need to go back to Serenity Isle. Serenity Isle really, really quick. Just to get some moves that I should have got before, before we went and... Uh, got shipwrecked because they uh they really 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 would have helped us uh, i can't remember what floor it is on at least the third floor might be higher might be higher um it's not this floor so fourth fourth floor maybe i think it's in here anyway um let's just check in here nope not in here uh, is it in here? Please be in here. Yes, it is. Okay, here we go. We can teach our Pokemon some moves. Uh, and as you can see, we have more money because we kept battling that bug catcher Nick dude, uh, and that swamp because he gives us money. And I think that's the fastest way of experience right now. Uh, I could be wrong, but we're gonna, we're gonna teach some Pokemon Leaf Blade. And, uh, I'm gonna do it the same as I had it in the, in the episode I tried recording earlier. Uh, I'm teaching it to Simba because, uh... Ground types uh, that can help get around ground types if we get into the situation where uh, he's up against a ground type and we can't do anything else with any other Pokemon. So I actually taught Leaf Blade to three of my Pokemon. I taught it to Simba, taught it to Spiral, just just so Spiral can have a little bit more variety of moves, and uh, also helped with ground types, which it's weak to. So we're gonna get rid of uh, Wrap. Almost forgot. Get rid of Wrapped. Wrap, and then the final, the final one that has Leaf Blade is uh, it's gonna be Finland, just to I guess just to basically deal with other water types. I don't know. It's just to give him more, more move, more of a more variety to his move pool. <clears throat> and now we're gonna teach a couple of them Spore. Our two fastest, which is Wind Waker, is our fastest. And we're going to get rid of Growl. Bye-bye, Growl. And you would think, you would think, Simba is our next fastest Pokemon. But no. I don't know why Simba, he looks fast, doesn't he? He looks fast. Yes, he does. Uh, I'll show you guys in a second. We're getting rid of rest because we don't need rest because we have uh, potions and stuff we could use instead. <clears throat> Alright, you, you guys want to see his speed. Okay. We'll compare speeds. Wind Waker has 83. Arbok is 57. Marshamp 38. Luxray 49. And then Jirachi 74. So you see how slow he is, which I think is stupid. He, he's a like a dog. He's a dog, and he's electric type. Electrics are supposed to be fast, right? Not Luxray. Luxray's the exception. 
silliness. Just, just, just silliness. Alright, now we can go after, after I do something real quick. Because of OCD purposes. Uh. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're not. Now you are. There we go. Now we can continue on. To Sea Spray. If you're coming with me, then we enjoy the sail, right? Where would you like to sail today? We're going to Sea Spray Town. So here we are in Sea Spray Town. And this girl again. I'm thinking that she pops up before, like, well, each new town that has a gym, maybe, before you go to each gym. I don't know. But, uh, Shell is here again. Cloud, what a shock to see you here. Look, I beat Sparky, and now Terry. They were easy wins for me. My bay leaf took them down with ease. Don't believe me? Come on, let's battle. <sighs> okay. But my trainer Shell sends out bay leaf, of course, level 30. Good thing we grinded up to 30. <laughs> so we're going to go for the wing attack. Can we Oko? Oh. Forgot to turn uh, battle animations and all that good stuff back on. She's got a super potion. That's fine. You can use all super potions you want. There's a crit. Doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter. And now we're not going to get the opportunity to switch. Because that's, that was turned off too in grinding it. We need to get out of here. So we're going into Finland. Please, I'm guessing you went for an electric type attack. You'd be stupid. Yeah, you'd be stupid not to. And uh, we can just go for some mud shots. Tail whip. Okay, have fun with that. Have fun with your tail whip. We're going to mud shot you. And that's a two hit KO. Plus your speed is lowered. I don't think we're going to outspeed you anyway. See? Raichu's quick. Raichu's electric. Like Luxray. But Luxray's not fast. No. Plus we're a marsh chomp. We're slow. We're very slow. <laughs> Alright, Shell is defeated. Come on, Bailey, please get up. Fine, you win. We got 1080 for winning. Humph. <laughs> you think you're clever, but my Pokemon were just weak from gym battle. They were full health. What are you talking about? Speaking of which, the gym leader left. Of course, the gym leader always leaves. Shortly after our match. If you plan on challenging her, you better go find her. In any case, I'm off to Stormy City for my fourth badge. Be seeing you. Fourth? Third? Oh, not again. Oh, going into this uh, other universe or whatever. Newport Richie. Um, hi. Hello? I like to fish for fun. I just always just release the fish I catch. What about when they attack you? Attack me? What on earth are you talking about? I shouldn't wander off too far. I don't want to get lost. Come on, Wolfie, you can't go back inside until you go pee. It's Poochie and I think I don't... What? I've never seen that kind of coloring on a Pokemon before. Wolfie. Wolfie! You didn't tell me you were Wolfie. Okay, you're Wolfie. Okay, Wolfie. Can we go inside any of these places? Door is locked. Of course not. Mumble Grumble, where, where are my keys? Holy cloud, you scared me. Please don't do that again. I suppose you're here for answers, right? Huh. You've been an excellent help to me, so I owe you an explanation. It's the least I can do. Our universes were never meant to be connected, but a great force is bringing them much too close. I don't think what's causing it... Wait, I don't know what's causing it, but I have a hunch it's a legendary Pokemon from your world. But it doesn't make sense. Just like you, I'm able to slip between our universes. I've even managed to gain control of it. As I showed you the first time you arrived, I've taken it upon myself to figure out what's going on and to stop it before dire things happen. The people here don't know of Pokemon. If they were found, I can't let that happen. Can I trust you with a, ta with a great task? I can't keep tab on what happens in your world. Please report to me any news of humans or Pokemon that may be the cause of our universe's merging. I realize you'll want to return home. The portal to your world has been shut, but is most likely able to be reopened. Look around where you arrived. You might be able to find a way back. 
Can't go that way. Can't go in the door. No. I want to take this car. Let's take this car. What? Uh, I feel like that that's that's not supposed to be there. <laughs> uh, talking car that says the same thing as this guy over here. I don't think so. I don't think so. You're a car? I didn't know you were a car. He's a car. Uh, I, I saw you talking with Luke. Are you, are you guys friends? He He's the one who does only one who doesn't make fun of me for liking the Pokemon games. He He says he's a Poke fan just like me. Are you a Poke fan too? You are. Oh wow. Thanks for cheering me up. A world without Pokemon. It must be awful to not have the feeling of love that only a Pokemon can give. That girl, she shouldn't be treated like an outsider because she cherishes that. This game knows what's up. Alright, so now we're back here. Where the wind meets the waves. I could have sworn I saw Phoebus that was ten feet long at least. You don't believe me, do you? I rarely get a nibble, but I'm fine with that. It gives me an excuse to see all the water Pokemon in their natural habitat. Alright. Even if you're riding a bike while Pokemon could jump you. What? What? I'm so confused. What's that supposed to mean? I clicked on the boat. Do we need to heal? Nah, no, we're good. We're good. Cisper Town is the most popular gateway from the Tuna region to the rest of the world. The SS Anne, Royal Unova, and SS Libra have all been here before. Is it your town, Fancy? Pokemon trainer by the name of Soheel lives on an island just outside of town. I hear that he's an excellent battler, but he really doesn't like people. Well, that's rude. Whee! Rumor is that Seaspray Town is one of the most relaxing towns to live in. I must say I agree. It's so boring here. Wow. Have you been to the department store? They have an excellent array of all sorts of things. I'll be there in just a second. My mom, or the, the gin leader, just went out on important business. Something about the sea spray dam. Huh. You'd think I'd get enough of the ocean on a normal day, but I still love to stroll along the shore. Alright, already been up there. I haven't talked to you yet, lady. The beach here is absolutely tiny. I wish I could go to Serenity Isle and soak in the rays there. Yep, this is, this, is a, this is a big beach. I don't know what you're talking about. That's really, that's really big. Sea spray dam. We're not going down there until next episode because I want to get just just this area, just this, just just this, just 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 this town explored. Some Pokemon might get burned from a fire type move attack. Is lowered if you have a burn. Yes, it is. Knock knock. What's on TV? Movies can be an excellent source of knowledge. For instance, I never knew that many legendary Pokemon had the ability of pressure. Pressure. Yes, they do. Pressure is the most common ability among legendaries. The more you know. I bet you can't catch me. Gotcha. Okay. Electric types tend to be very fast, while rock types tend to be very slow. Ugh, it's not luxury, though. Stop it. Humans aren't the only ones who like good food. Pokemon are just as happy to eat delicious food as we are. I could go for some delicious food right now. I'm really hungry. My husband offered me or offered to make dinner for me. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. All right. Let's go in here. Hello, blue-haired sir. Hello, I'm the movie learner. I know the moves of every single Pokemon. I'll teach them for you for 500. No thanks. Is that the last uh, last area we've? Okay. Yep. Looks like it. Okay. So let's go into this. Uh, this big mart, this big department store. Hello, Cyndaquil man. I wanted to buy my Cyndaquil a nice DM, but I don't know which one. So many choices. Welcome to Seaspray Department Store. Thank you. It's wonderful to just go shopping every now and then, right? Yeah, yeah, I guess so. I can't believe I'm at the Seaspray Department Store. I can't believe I'm actually here. It was ranked the fifth best department store in Tunod Tourism Magazine. There are items nowadays that I treat every type of status ailment. When I was a trainer, all we had were berries. 
It's always hard deciding what to buy for a trip. Under preparing is bad, but over preparing can take quite a chunk out of your wallet. Yes, that's true. Mommy's taking too long shopping, so I decided to play. Alright, what do you sell? You sell some... Actually, I don't even know what our items look like right now. I haven't looked at them for a while. Alright, so we're pretty decent on our healing items. Some full heals could be used, though. Need to buy some more Pokeballs. Almost forgot we had Dragon Claw. Yeah, let's buy some more Pokeballs. And a, some full heals, first of all. Let's buy some Great Balls. Let's even it off at 6 so we could get 10. Do we have any escape ropes? Let's buy one. Uh, full heal. Let's buy 3. Sounds like a good number. Fluffy Tail. Use to flee from any battle with wild Pokemon. Okay, cool. What do you sell? Same stuff, different stuff. Potions. Okay. We don't have any potions, do we? Okay, that could be a problem. Let's buy seven. What is this floor? Many lazy trainers think that using a lot of carbos or protein is a substitute for training. Remember that it's not. Okay. How can this department store not have a single floor with clothes? That's a good question. Uh, who cares about your X attack? X items are booty. Uh, yep. And I'm guessing you sell the X items and and guard spec or whatever. Yep, there you go. Dire hit as well. And uh, um, let's just let's just see what they got. Let's just see what they got. Team thirty eight, a powerful fire attack that may burn the foe. Oh, it sounds like flame. Is it flamethrower, thunderbolt, and ice beam? And that's a uh, probably hyper beam. But we're broke. We don't have money for that. And uh, negates all damage, but may fail if used in succession. Mm. Protect, detect. I don't know. Prevents all. Prevents status abnormal abnormality with a mystical power. Safeguard probably. Creates a wall of light that weakens physical attacks. Reflect. And uh, that has to be light screen. And it looks like this is the top floor. What do you guys sell at the top floor? You guys sell evolutionary stones. Okay, that's not bad. I'll remember that if I need to evolve something because all I have is a moonstone. I guess I could have taken the elevator, which is over there, but nah. Oh, we haven't gone this way, I don't think. So he'll straight. Oh. Dire hit. Okay, so I'm guessing that Soheal guy lives up that way. But of course we don't have Surf and uh, we can't take a boat there at the moment. I don't know if we can later or not. But uh, I think that's pretty much the entire town uh, explored now. We, I got, I'm guessing we're going to go um, this way in the next episode. To the Sea Spray Dam where the gym leader is so we can get her back up here and battle her and try and get our second gym badge. I think it's our second gym badge, right? Yeah, our second gym badge. So if you guys did enjoy this episode of our Pokemon Glaze Nuzlocke, please leave a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Maybe, maybe, if, if you, if you want to see more content. And uh, I'd really appreciate that. I'll see you guys next time.